Tis the season, Christmas is right around the corner and all this month on Taste of the Desert, we're gonna show you how to make some different holiday treats. This week we come here to Massimo and Rancho Mirage. We're gonna go inside, meet the chef and show you how to make eggnog. Now we're in the kitchen here at Massimo with chef and owner Joe Gasbari, and you're gonna show us how to make this eggnog. This is a right. long time tradition during the holidays. What do you need to get started, Joe? Well, first off, we're gonna start with a little milk. Mm -hmm. We have uh, whipping cream okay. and sugar, nutmeg, a little vanilla extract, and of course, the egg. All right, we got all of our ingredients. What do we need to get started? All right, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take the eggs. We're gonna crack them, and we're gonna separate the egg yolks. We have three quarters of a cup of sugar. We're not gonna put it all in the egg yolk. We're just gonna put about, we're gonna leave about a quarter of a cup actually for the whipping cream as well. And how long do we need to whip that? Will you be able to tell the consistency? Yeah, I'll show you the consistency as well. About halfway through, you wanna stop and add a little bit of your vanilla extract. And I add about a quarter of a teaspoon. Very little, this is strong stuff. That's about the consistency you want. Alrighty, what do we add in next? All right, we pull that aside, refrigerate that. And then we take our egg whites that are remaining in the separation. And we beat these with four egg whites. It should take us no more than about three minutes. Okay. And that's the point you want to get to, that soft peak stage. We're going to take one cup of our heavy cream. We're also going to take the remaining sugar that's left, which is about a quarter of a cup. And then we are going to whip this to the same point we did the uh, egg whites, which was to the soft peak stage. And at this point is where the fun begins. We take our egg yolk mixture, sugar that we have here, and vanilla extract. At this point, we can start adding our flavorings. Uh, you can do a couple mix-ins. You can use a little bit of traditional rum. Uh, we happen to choose to use a quarter cup of rum and a quarter cup of frangelico. You can also use chocolate if you'd like. Well, Joe, I am working, I'm on the clock, so we'll go for the chocolate. Exactly, all okay, right, no problem. We're gonna add a little bit of milk too to this, uh, just to lower the consistency so it's not so thick as well. Um, and that's also the taste. I use about a cup. We're gonna add a little bit of nutmeg. I think this stuff's really strong. I have about literally an eighth of a teaspoon that I add to this. You can choose to put cinnamon in as well if you'd like. And then we add a little bit of our chocolate. Uh, about a quarter of a cup. Who doesn't like chocolate? If you choose to, you can garnish it with a little bit of whipped cream on top and then some chocolate. Um, cinnamon stick, if you put cinnamon in there. Very I'm ready to try this stuff. Let's go out front and uh, toast to the season with our eggnog, all right? Perfect, let's do let's some go. noggin. Mm. Joe, very rich, creamy, and I love the addition of the chocolate. Kind of spruces it up. Thanks for making it for us. Give this eggnog a try right here at Massimo this month only for the holiday season or simply log on to KESQ.com and make it at home for a little taste of the desert. And we'll see you next week. Cheers.